What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome to my current subscribers. And welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button and be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, caps to Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Free general collective reading for all signs. Um, I received another channeling. I told you guys I was about to go out of town, and I am. But when I was driving to the restaurant to go eat, uh, I got channeling, so I came back. I wasn't far, so just saying. I hope everybody's doing well. Um, if you like uh, my channel and you think anyone else could benefit or would enjoy the stories, etc., 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 please feel free to share my channel very publicly via social media and word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. Uh, okay, so I heard um, through many series of chain of events, an older Pisces feminine, I heard your former boss. Um, is about to be hugely exposed in a court situation soon. I heard she's going to perjure herself, and there's going to be evidence um, that she that she has perjured herself. It is about to turn in your favor in a huge way. I heard you will not be present. You plug it in, how it resonates. I don't know why you're not going to be present. Um, I thought, I, I, I don't know. I guess it's not against you. Uh, I don't know why you're not going to be present. Um, I have no idea. Um, if I guess it's against somebody else for, and they're talking about you. I'm not sure why you're not going to be present. Um, I don't know. But it's, an old, it's your former boss that this resonates for you. It's your former boss, and she is an older Pisces pimp. So um, I feel she could be 35 or above. For some of you guys, I feel she could probably be a heck of a lot older. Um, and I'm just being for real. Um, but however that resonates, um, she's about to perjure herself. It sounds like I'm staying. Um, there's some kind of court situation going on. Somehow you are brought up in this court situation, but you're not there. So I don't think it's against you or what, ha uh, what have you, what have you, but somehow you're involved with it. But I heard, uh, she's going to perjure herself. She's going to perjure herself on a stand. And, um, basically it's going to go well for you. So, um, she could have Pisces in her sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, mini, and Jupiter charts. She's your old, uh, she's your old boss. She's a feminine energy. Um, you plug in and how it resonates. For some, she's in her 30s. For some, she's in her 50s. For some, she's in her 60s. For some, she's in her 30s. For some, she's in her 50s. For some, she's in her 60s. So you plugging in how it resonates. Um, she she has Pisces in her chart in some shape, form, or fashion. Pisces feminine, um, former boss of yours. If this resonates for you, for some she's in her thirties, for some she's in her fifties, for some she's in her sixties. So you plug it in how it resonates, but you will not be present. Um, and but it's about to benefit you in a huge way. I heard there's about to be some kind of evidence proving that she's lying. I think from the other party. Um, or a subpoenaed witness or something of that nature how that resonates um wow man you plug it in how it resonates for some it's involving an illegal case study of the past for some it's involving this pisces feminine doppelganger you in an investigation of the past. For some, it's involving money laundering and fraud. Okay, for some, it's involving money laundering and fraud. For some, this Pisces fan doppelganger doppelgangs you in the past, so basically pretended to be you um, and stole money from you, it sounds like, be an investigation of a past, of the past. And for some, it's involving an illegal, an illegal case study of the past. That's a lot. So you plug it in how it resonates. People, I mean, the shit I pull in here, what people do, I mean, I know people do this shit, but my God, why? This is sick shit, and I am just being for real. It is, it's sick is what it is. Um, just do it the right way. Some is involving an illegal case study of the past. Some it's involving uh, the Pisces fam former boss doppelganging you, so pretending to be you in an investigation. Sounds like they got money stole from you. Um, in the investigation, and some it's involving um, theft and fraud. 
For some, they're in their 30s. For some, they're in their 50s. For some, they're in their 60s. They could have Pisces in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or them in energy for charts. You plug it in how it resonates. Another Pisces is getting a huge wake-up call. Another Pisces is getting a huge wake-up call. So you plug it in how it resonates. And it flew out, you guys. It flew. They're a huge-ass thief. Bad health reverse. Number 24 or 31 could be very significant numbers in one's life. 24 or 31, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number in one's life. 24 or 31. Through many series of chain of events, this Pisces fem former boss will throw a Libra feminine under the bus in a huge way for some and an Aquarius fem under the bus in a huge way. For some, a Scorpio. Okay. So for some of these people, they're going to, uh, it sounds like once they get exposed, it sounds like on the stand or by a subpoena witness or witnesses or some kind of evidence. Um, uh, some of them are going to throw an Aquarius fem under the bus. Some a, um, what I hear, Aquarius fem for some, for some a, um, uh, Scorpio, and for some, um, what was the other one? You have to go back and check it. You have to go back and check it. Uh, Aquarius, Femme, Scorpio, and there was another one. Um, Libra Femme, Libra Femme. So you plug it in, how it resonates. They have stole from you. They have lied on you, stole from you, thieved you, etc., etc., etc. You plug it in, how it resonates. Bad health reverse. For some, they claimed you were a drug addict. For some, they claimed you were alcoholic. For some, they claimed you were both. For some, they claimed you were schizophrenic. But you are none of those. And someone knows this. Things are about to turn out for you in a huge positive way. Man, these people just done the most. And I'm just being for real. So they... The, so they Basically, okay, so they basically, this is so sick. They basically justify stealing money from you. Okay, there was an illegal, there, I'm not illegal. There was an investigation done in the past on you. But it doesn't sound like you were involved in the investigation. It sounds like one of your former bosses pretended to be you. When the, inve um, the investigation cleared, it sounds like they got money. But they pretended to be you the whole time. But now they're about to be in court battles or they already are in court battles because they have harmed you in some shape, form, or fashion. Some through illegal case study, some through theft, some through fraud. So you name it, you name it. But however it resonates, they're justifying or they did try to justify that you, some you're alcoholic, some you're a drug user, some you're both, and some you're schizophrenic. But I heard basically none of it's true. None of it's true. It is about to seriously backfire on them in a huge way. Seriously. It is about to seriously backfire on them in a huge way. Seriously. So they were claiming you had bad health left right, basically. Um, that you can't take care of yourself. That you can't do for yourself. That you, um, you go, you're you drowning in a bottle. You're drowning uh, with drug use. You're drowning. Um, you're seeing auditory hallucinations or visual hallucinations not spiritual downloads like this but i mean like true mental health issues like schizophrenia um etc 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 or what have you with schizophrenia I'm, i mean i'd have to look up the medical diagnosis of schizophrenia to tell you exactly what all what all is going on with schizophrenia i don't know let's look it up but um but I heard you're none of those. You're none of those. But they're only doing it to defend themselves because of the abuse they put on you in the past, basically. And once they get exposed, they're going to expose other people. Um, I heard of Aquarius fam, um, Scorpio, and um, and um, Libra fam. Schizophrenia, a disorder that affects a person's ability to think, feel, and behave clearly. The exact cause of schizophrenia isn't known, but a combination of genetics, environment, and altered brain chemistry and structure may play a role. Um,
But it sounds like they did an illegal case study on some of you guys. For some, there was an investigation on you in the past. And um, basically, they stole money from you. Didn't even tell you there was an investigation going on. But they're basically trying to claim you're schizophrenic, you're alcoholic, you're a drug user, blase, blase, blase. But none of it's true. None of it's true. Okay. Five types of symptoms characteristic of schizophrenia. Delusions, hallucinations, disorganized speech, disorganized behavior, and the so-called negative symptoms, which I have no idea what those are. What triggers schizophrenia? Research suggests a combination of physical, genetic, and psychological and environmental factors. Um, they might have gang-stalked you in the past for some of them. They might have gang-stalked you, possibly, to try to cause schizophrenia, maybe for some of you guys. Um, this is sick. This is sick, sick, sick. Schizophrenia is a serious mental disorder in which people interpret reality abnormally. This is sick. But in reality, they are the, the ones that have mental health issues uh, because you. this is financial abuse. This is financial abuse. They have financially abused you and other ways abused you, but they want to claim that you are schizophrenic or you are an alcoholic or you are the drug user. Yeah, right. Someone is getting a huge wake-up call. Someone is getting a huge wake-up call. I'm serious. I'm going to pull another card. This is sick, man. Freedom of religion is about to come very significant in this. Freedom of religion is about to come very significant in this. And one of these people is in the middle of a lawsuit right now with a religious organization, and they will lose in a huge way. And one of these people is in the middle of a lawsuit right now with a religious organization, and I heard they will lose in a huge way. So one of them is in the middle of a lawsuit with a religious organization right now, and I heard they will lose in a huge way. So, um, maybe one of you guys is a religious organization that's taking these people, um, for a lawsuit, I'm feeling. Maybe I'm feeling for some. Um, because there's a reason I'm pulling that in. So, um, you plug it in how it resonates. Compassion, upright, new beginnings, reverse. The death of an Aries masculine is about to become very significant in one of these people's lives as well. Very significant. Sudden death. Oh my lord. I've been pulling in a death of an Aries masculine very strong since yesterday. Okay, I heard a, a death of an Aries masculine is about to become very significant in one of these people's lives. Um, sudden death. So it's going to happen quickly and suddenly, and I don't think anybody's going to expect it, whoever this Aries masculine is. If it's, if it's the same one I've been pulling in in the energetic space, um, he has heart conditions, pre-existing heart conditions and other conditions. So I think, I think it might be an MI or a stroke or TIA or something of that nature. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates, but um, for some it might be that same one. For some it could be a different one. Um, ugh. I heard the death of an Aries masculine is about to become very significant in one of these people's lives. Um, these people had no compassion for you in the past. None. Through many series of chain of events, they're about to receive very heavy negative karma. They're so selfish and greedy. And someone is noticing civil rights violations and other violations, and they're about to take huge compassion upon your story. Okay, I heard these people had basically no compassion for you in the past, no compassion, no sympathy, no empathy, so compassion reversed. And basically, um, they were basically just greedy and selfish. They did the legal case study or did the, uh, pretended they were you in the investigation or stole or frauded you or what have you, what have you basically for money and for greed and for selfishness. Um, but I heard somebody else is about to take huge compassion upon your story. I think it might be a judge or the opposing counsel or somebody else. Um, how that resonates 
and I heard uh, basically it's going to go very well for you. So um, they're about to have compassion, sympathy, and empathy towards your story. These people did not. Um, and it's evident with their actions because action, actions speak louder than words. Um, and I'm just serious. Um, you can claim somebody's schizophrenic and an alcoholic and a drug user all day long, but are they really? Whoever this person is, whoever you are, sir or ma'am, you're not. Um, and they're clearly lying through the skin of their teeth. But somebody knows this. Somebody knows this, and they're about to take compassion upon you, empathy, sympathy, and with the facts. Obviously, the facts are you're not a drug user, you're not an alcoholic, and you're obviously not schizophrenic. And religion has bearing on this as well, because uh, one of these people is currently in a lawsuit with a religious organization, so somehow religion, religion has bearing on this as well. Um, I feel for some you're a reader, and I'm just being for real. I feel for some you're a reader, and you get downloads from the spiritual universe. In a very healthy, non-drug use, taking shrooms kind of way, um, you get natural downloads from the universe to protect you and your collective, is what I feel. And they're trying to use that to claim you're schizophrenic. But what these people don't understand, since I've been doing this for two and a half years, I can vouch on it, is they're not, the downloads, the natural spiritual downloads do not come from outside. They don't come from external, outside like seeing something on the outside or hearing something on the outside. It comes internally. It comes internally from spirit. Spirit delivers it energetically from the in, inside of us. Um, anybody that is a true reader knows this. They know this. They know this. They know this. I know you guys are true readers. Uh, I know I, a lot of you guys started off with me, and now you're true readers, and you know this. So it wouldn't even... And, um, when I first get it, started getting downloads, I was, I, of course, y'all know, I was a nurse a long time before I started getting downloads, but once I started getting downloads, I was worried. I was, uh, about the downloads, but I realized it doesn't affect my external. It doesn't affect me going out in the world. I worked for a year and a half, a year and a half, still receiving downloads, still having this channel, still working. I work full time, 40, sometimes 40, 40 plus hours. For a year and a half, having this channel, maintaining a full-time job, and raising two kids by myself. So I know it, did, it didn't affect me out in 3D, and it still doesn't, because there's certain ways you do this to produce the channelings. There's a certain process I do before I get on here. I relax, I meditate, I deep breathe, and then we do it. Um, sometimes I get in while I'm in my vehicle, like I did today, but I was relaxing and meditating. I was chilling. Um, these people were trying to make a mountain to a molehill because they stole from you, prodded you, claimed they were you in an investigation because they're liars, basically. New beginnings reversed. They are about to be so stuck, so, so, so stuck in their lies. They're about to be so, so stuck in their lies, so stuck. So stuck energy, new beginnings reverse. They're about to be so stuck in their lies. You plug it in, how it resonates. And one of their husbands is about to ask for a divorce. And one of their husbands is about to ask for a divorce. Oh, my God. So they're about to be so stuck in their lies. And one of their husbands is about to ask for a divorce. We're pulling in at least three of these people. Um, one, they're in their 30s. One, they're in their 50s. One, they're in their 60s. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, and one of their husbands is about to ask for a divorce. There's obviously a lot of wealth here, um, but I feel for some of you guys, they they basically built it off your ass. And that's just the truth. Emergence. And someone's about to reveal that kids were taken away from a single mother to for money. All the money is about to be have to be repaid back soon through many series of chain of events. And someone's about to reveal that kids were taken away from a single mother for money. And I heard basically um, all the money is going to have to be repaid back through many series of chain of events. So emergence in this aspect is emergence of information. 
that basically somebody's kids were taken away from them, basically for money. Um, and I heard all the money's going to have to be repaid back through many series of shame events. So emergence of information, I think for one of you guys, you're about to reveal this information. Um, for one of you guys, it could be somebody else you're connected to revealing this information. You plug it in, how it resonates. But that's really sick. That's really sick. Hashtag live free if anybody needs to hear that. Um, we shouldn't be dabbling in other people's energy, dabbling in other people's um, lives, um, spying on them through hidden cameras or in doing illegal case studies on people. If anybody needs to hear that or frauding or thieving them or pretending to be them in an investigation, because that is fraud and that is theft. Um, and that's just the truth. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. All right, you guys. I love you guys so much. I hope this helped. And let me see if I hear anything else. Number 31 or 24 could be very significant numbers. Number 31 or 24. Okay, I didn't hear anything else. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody have a wonderful day and namaste.